Hey, what's up, y'all? As we are heading to the station right now, I'm back at it again, I guess. For our throwback Thursday today, we're gonna try to do some LCPDFR. Um, as far as like how glitchy this game is, I mean, I would advise you not to even try it, but I mean, if you don't mind the headaches and all that stuff, go ahead. I mean, trying to install all the mines one by one, but it will take you some time and a lot of crashes. So I kind of like that's one thing I don't miss about this is the crashes. Like I'm so used to GTA 5 now is the fact that it's really hard to play this and the driving feels so different. But you know what? It's Thursday and I always promise you guys at least a GTA 4 video, of course, and we're going to go to the station and let's get this show on the road, man. All right, let's go. OK, um, yeah, so we just made it to the station. That's when we usually cross our fingers, because once you made it to the station, you're going to you're going to be able to tell if the game is going to work or not. But right now, we're just going to pick an officer just to make sure that you know what? Let's do highway patrol. Um, I think the the folder that, that have been working for me so far is the highway patrol one. So we are just going to pick. Nope this officer I got to change the pants we gonna have long sleeve and the pants and yes mostly you guys usually ask why do I still wear the boots um even though I'm driving a vehicle it's the fact that high repertoire in New York do that also because most of the time half of the day they have to um get on the bike and also use their regular vehicles so anyway let's get started all right Nope, we're not going to be using this Ottima. I don't know. I might use this Taurus, but you know what? Let me see what other car do I have. This is the Amar Crown. No. Oh, no. No, I thought I had the High Rider Patrol on um, the CVPR with the High Riser, but I guess I don't. Anyway, you know what? Let's just use the Taurus and we'll see how it's going to turn out. But one thing we haven't used in a while, which Frank Horn, um took his sound to create, is uh, the radar gun mod. But you know what? Let me just clean my vehicle. As you guys could see, the game still work, but it took me forever to actually um, get the game to that point. And from the ENB mods to installing each cars one by one, the weapons, the uniforms. So it's it's been a while. Oh, I have to be in a car to start the radar gun. All right. This was Frank Korn. Like, I don't know. He came up with that idea and it was definitely a great job. That was one mod that was really successful for GTA 4. And it might not be working for me right now because I probably didn't reload scripts. But with GTA 4, I really don't want to reload scripts right now or restart the game because it might crack. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. But y'all y'all didn't hear that. We're gonna act like <laughs> we didn't hear none of that. Um yeah. It's I mean that that usually works, but right now I don't know for some reason it's not working. But we're gonna try. I know it's usually D4. Cause I was gonna try to run at least the radar and we could catch some speeders, but look like it might not re and might not be working properly. Let me see if I could. Oh, I can't even pull it out. What? No, come on. All right, I can't wait until you know what? That's one thing I'm going to talk to Frank on about for him to create this for GTA 5. I know we have multiple radar stuff for GTA 5, but we, if we could have something like this, like when you point the gun at the car, the radar gun at a, at a car or whatever and get the speed, but this one seems like it's not working. Yep, it's like I have to pull out my gun just for it to. But we don't want to spend the whole episode trying to get this radar gun to work. <laughs> nah, I have to have my weapons out. But anyway, if you um, I think I might have to like re reinstall everything anyway, because last time I mean this is the only copy that's working for me so far. And to really get this game to work, it's um, it will definitely take a while and you have to get used to. Oh, they both turn at the same time. 
Yeah, uh, you have to get used to crashes and all that stuff. That's one thing we're not used to in GTA 5. I mean, we do get that in GTA 5, but it's not as much as as far as you start. Like sometimes you start in the game, you just get a random crash for no reason. And then you just have to keep going with that. But enough about the radar gun. Let's just start with this patrol. But anyway, um, welcome back to uh, Throwback Thursday. Uh, this is one of my favorite tours, which uh, we have in New York now with the high riser. And most people usually ask, why do they have the high riser? It's, uh, it's mostly for highway patrol. Why? Because they like to be seen from far away, at least. So they could warn you either there's an accident or traffic is going to be slowing down. So whatever it is, they use it for. But it's mostly for accident or whatever. But right now we, we could just park right over here. Oh, okay. We got a bunch of bikers without no helmet. <laughs> we can start up with that. I don't have my radar gun, so even catching the Lambo speeding ring now, we can even give them a ticket. But you know what? We're going to start off with the first guy right over here. Come on. Isn't it? Oh, okay. I almost forgot how to pull over now. It's been a while since we did this, right? It's been over a month since we actually got back to GTA 4, which is one of the message you guys have been seeing um, in GTA 5 when you are done with a call with um, Corner. They always wonder how Steve Trackboys is doing in Liberty City, of course. But anyway, we're just going to raise that up just so, you know, everybody could be warned. At least, you know, I'm on a traffic stop right now. Um, we're going to talk to this guy right now and figure out why he's not wearing no safety gear. Oh, he decided to run away from me. Really, dude? All right, this guy's running away. Um, we're going to call for backup. But with my finger crossed right now, because when you call for backup, it usually crash the game. So we call him for backup right now. And let's see. All right, so this patch know that I am chasing somebody right now, but <laughs> we're not going to try to call for too much backup because it usually crashed the game. But let's try to see. Maybe we could get him off the bike. All right, so we got backup heading all the way right now. And, Suspect headed south. and they have to block me. Of course, typical GTA stuff. Like, really? Why would you drive in front? Why would you make the U turn in front of me, dude? Oh, damn, he's about to crash. Too. Oh, I thought that was the guy. Oh my god, backup just crashed. Just totally vehicle. Oh, I had to avoid them, so I gotta make the left now. Missed my turn. Shit. Fucking with backup. Anyway, um. Oh man, I forgot that you can actually lose them in this. It's not like GTA 5. Oh, in a, uh, All right, I'm by the time I'm done with this chase, my vehicle's gonna be total. Attention, this is dispatch. Target we lost. A, um, white red I'm just trying to fix. Okay, we lost. We lost a suspect, but um, we. The last time they saw them was oh shoot. You guys didn't see that. There's a siren outside that actually sound exactly like the one I'm using right now. Okay. Oh no, 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 it's actually in the game. <laughs> they sound exactly the same. Because I'm using NYPD right now. I, I lost tracks of them. Alright, he's on a red bike. I don't think he made the left though. I'm waiting on dispatch to update me with his look. Okay, damn. Dispatch just update the location. All right, so we went the wrong way. Damn, I haven't had one of these chases in a while. And with GTA 4, you feel like you're freaking driving a ball right now. What the hell? You feel like you you in a oh, man. This this is not good at all. And my car's about to get total. Oh White shit. Red on okay, we spot him. We spot him. Alright, so it looks like I'm gonna try to knock him off the bike. Whenever we get a chance, we're gonna try to knock him off the bike. Oh shit, he just, just freaking played me. Alright, when we get a chance again, 
This guy is really not giving up. And um, I just don't want him to crash the game right now because we're just going to keep going. We up to like what? 10? About 10 minutes already? Westbound on Garnet Street. In uh, a um, red white pitch. red bagger. What? Oh, bagger. Damn, he's just not falling off. All right. Damn. Come on. Oh, shoot. I just want him off the bike. Come on. All right, this is this is what happened when you can't even call for backup. I remember before we oh damn, <laughs> you really played me on that one. I remember before how we used to call for backup like crazy. We can't even do backup on fleek on this one. Damn. All right, my car's about to get away. Okay, okay, I got him. I got him. I gotta make sure I get him off the bike. I know this is so unrealistic, but we gotta do this. Oh no, when you press E, oh. Gotta get off this computer. He probably ran away. Oh, okay. He, damn, you didn't even run away, dude. All right, put your hands up. Put your hands up, sir. Why is not working? With the controller, it doesn't grab the pads. Like, come on, dude. Put your hands up. All right, he's just not cooperating. I don't want to shoot him either. Come on. Ah, oh, damn. We're gonna have to chase this guy now. We're gonna have to chase this guy. Yeah. Get on the ground. Man, it is not the same key as GTA 5. Damn, that sucks. All right, I'm just calling for backup because I can't arrest them, but they they will be able to. So I hope they are gonna be able to arrest them. All right, they just tase them. I'm just gonna back them up. Hopefully, he won't pull out a gun or anything like that because I didn't get a chance to search him. And yeah, he's under arrest. All right, <laughs> damn, I got lucky though. Anyway, we're just gonna move on from that. Um, let's run some more traffic and we'll see how that's gonna turn out. All right, so we're just cruising right now. I'm just watching everybody, you know, anybody driving crazy right now. We're just gonna stop them, but I'm going back to my spot where I could actually um, run, I mean, test the radar gun again. But we'll see how that's gonna turn out. What's up with this Hummer? Driving extremely slow. And driving on two lane. All right, you know what? We're gonna pull over the Hummer. Come on, come on, come on. Let me get behind you. All right, we're gonna pull him over along, right now. Stupid. Cooperate. Come on, come on. Just cooperate. All right. Uh, still blue poly Patriot, nineteen ninety six. All right. There's no flags on that vehicle, so most likely I'm just going to check out to see if he's not drunk or if there's anything wrong with him. And most likely we we'll probably just give him a warning or something like that. We were, oh, we were just going to give you a warning. All right, this guy decided to run for it. Suspect Are you mobile. freaking serious? All right, look like our throwback Thursday is going to be all about chases today. We just finished our first chase a second ago, and it took us about 10 minutes to get to actually get this guy, but it looked like we starting another chase and this how Hummer is that fast. Unbelievable. Yo, this guy, this guy left me in the dust. All right, this guy's all oh, okay. We catching up now. Look like okay. He he had to turn. That's why we catching up. All right, so I did call for backup. Hopefully they will show up, but right now we on our own. Uh, we are primary. Just chasing this Hummer right now. Come on. And he's careless right now. Oh no, I didn't mean to call news. Not news. I mean just regular backup. Alright, anyway, if news show up, they're just gonna shut him down, so. Oh, just hit another vehicle. 1050 another vehicle. Damn. And another one. Oh damn. This guy just don't care. All right, most of you guys usually say not to like, you know, shoot from your vehicle or whatever, but this guy is so careless right now. I might end up shooting him. But right now because he's he's just trying to kill people right now. Oh, and 1050 in the back of that car. Oh, all right. We're going to try to stop him. Come on, grandpa. Grandpa. Come on, get out the <laughs> shit. He's just trying to escape. 
all right and as you guys already know texture disappearing all right that's already sign of the game it's acting up already but you know what this is gonna be our last chase for today but we're gonna stop we're gonna have to stop grandpa over here all right damn i'm just, I'm just trying to change to my glock all right get out the car get out the freaking truck oh, get out all right so we're gonna try to arrest grandpa come on damn he's just not cooperating just got hit by a car just got hit by the Range Rover. All right, Grandpa, give up. Give up, Grandpa. Give. Oh my God, Grandpa just not give up. Grandpa pull out a gun. Oh my. Oh, I had to put him down. Damn. Wow. All right, he was trying to take another vehicle to at least get away from us, but damn. Wow. Okay, so it looked like we only had two chases in this, um, I guess, episode or whatever, but. This is my time for now. Um, hopefully you guys are gonna enjoy this throwback Thursday and maybe we'll do some fire firefighter stuff or whatever it is. But anyway, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Until next time, guys. Peace.